Now, one of my favorite monster movie stories is the Frankenstein casting. I am Dracula. I bet that was very confusing. So, Paul Gossi is obviously very famous for playing the role of Dracula. And uh, after the huge success of the film, a uh, production approached him and asked if he would play the role of Frankenstein's monster. And he originally said, no, I don't want to do that. There are no lines. <laughs> and they eventually convinced him to do it. Uh, on one condition, he had to do his own makeup as the monster. So we do have some photos of him doing his own makeup as the monster. He later showed production his end result, and they ended up laughing at him, saying that he wasn't scary at all, he was just funny. So he said, fine, I'm not gonna do it. You can get any extra to play the role of Frankenstein's monster. So that's what they did, they got an extra, and that extra was Boris Karloff. And Boris Karloff ended up playing Frankenstein's monster in all of the Universal Studios productions. <laughs> all right, everyone, it looks like we have access to Soundstage 50. This is very exciting as it is considered a hot set, uh, which means they're setting up for a production right now. Uh, in this case, a TV show. So we just want to remind everybody to please remain seated at all times, keeping your arms and legs fully inside of the vehicle. Hang on tight to those belongings. Hang on tight to those phones. We don't want to lose anything on their set. Now, you are allowed to take photos of Soundstage 50 and recording as well, uh, but we ask that you please do not use any type of flash photography inside of the Soundstage. So set design came in several weeks ago to turn Soundstage 50 into a BART station in San Francisco. Now the BART sort of works as a subway system in the Bay Area. And uh, on your left hand side you will see that production has already started to bring in some props, some equipment for filming. It really goes to show you how much I don't know if you want to sometimes. So usually when oh, Alright everyone, we're experiencing an earthquake. Please remain seated. is over. We should be fine now. Or not. setting up for a TV show right now. But TV shows have filmed in there, including the TV show Bones. Now they used that set you just saw, but they also used the practical effects that we all just survived. Take a look. Everyone, all of this water and danger kind of reminds me of something else. Welcome to Amity Island. This is from Jaws, directed by Steven Spielberg, came out in 1975. It's okay though, they've caught the shark. I can up right there. Uh oh, is that music by John Williams? It is, we're in trouble everyone, there's a shark in the water. Please remain seated at all times, keeping your arms and legs fully inside of the vehicle. 
Especially if you want to keep them, because there's a shark in the water. Oh no, and it looks like George is in the water too. George is our diver. It's his first day. George! George, I know it's your first day, George! You don't need to impress us though. George, there's a shark! George! Oh no, it's also George's last day. Well, Universal Studios is hiring a scuba diver. All right, I think if we hide behind this dock right here, we should be totally fine. These very large gasoline tanks will keep us safe. My mother always said, India, if you're in danger, hide behind the closest gasoline tank you can find. Okay. This isn't ideal, but you know what? At least there's no sign of a shark. You're all thinking, India, that's a fake shark. Yes, yes, it is a fake shark, but I saw you jump. It got you just a little bit. So this mechanical shark actually works incredibly well, unlike the shark that they used in the movie Jaws, where that shark sank to the bottom of the ocean on the very first day of filming. So the crew ended up nicknaming the film Flaws. Wah, wah. That's a much maligned shark. The shark was frustrating. It, it didn't really work all the time. It didn't work hardly at all. Wherever you were on the island, you could hear the radio calls. They were always saying, the shark is not working. Repeat, the shark is not working. We just waited around. We just waited and waited and waited. The shark worked well enough for a while there in the biggest of all time. So I really owe the shark a lot. Now, you may also recognize this set as Cabot Cove in Murder, She Wrote, starring Angela Lansbury. Why are you humming me? I love that song. All right, now to your right hand side, you're gonna see Chicken Ranch. Now, Chicken Ranch was first constructed in Soundstage 12 before they later brought it out here to our back lot. So it kind of gives you an idea of how large those sound stages really are. And again, Soundstage 12 is around 30,000 square feet. Make sure you write that down. There is a quiz at the end of the tour. I'm just kidding. I, I'm not trying to stress anyone.